Hello friends and welcome back to Naturally Sprigs as I show you how I lay my landscaping fabric spring of 2022. And mind you, these, these are fabrics that I had uh, in the previous year and I just reused them because they were kind of pricey. So it was a good investment, but I was able to use them again. And just like last year, um, well, not exactly like last year. Last year, I had this walkway that I dug. Some of you may have seen my pictures on Facebook or Instagram um, as I progressed in creating this walkway. However, uh, the weeds overtook it so bad, so I said, well, let me go ahead and uh, put this landscaping fabric down this year to see if it works better for me. So that's what I'm doing now. I'm just replacing the bricks that I, were given. I was given. These were a gift. Um, someone was get, getting rid of them, so I went ahead and repurposed them. Thank you. All right. Got the first part done. So I'm back the next day, and as you can see, I'm beginning the process of actually stapling them now. So I end up doing this all the way down this path here and I had originally planned on cutting the grass down before I did this and perhaps pulling up the weeds but that didn't work out so <laughs> that's what I end up doing so on the side here I'm also going to be putting down rows of landscaping fabric uh, similarly to how my my garden was laid uh, laid out last year what I did last year, however, is I did lay the fabric down, but in certain sections I pulled it up. And now I had wished that I had laid it, let it stay. So this year I'm laying the fabric down and I'm going to let it stay down and just plant accordingly. So just like the pathway you just saw, I too will be stapling this down to make sure it stays down good. And I have to make sure every corner is down because the wind comes through this yard pretty strong and it can lift it up. I've had that happen. I've gone through so many of these landscaping staples. It's probably over 200 of them at least. <laughs> There's my silly little cat, Miss Izzy. She loves being outside and sleeping around. So over here, um, as you can see, this is the second landscaping fabric that I've laid, and then now on to the third that I'm working on now. Oh, and there's my kitty. Yes, that is his name, Kitty. K-E-D-I, just like the documentary from Istanbul. Yeah, so I came over here to work on the fourth uh, area that I'm uh, landscaping, putting the landscaping fabric down, excuse me, but they were full of ants. So I used this essential oil blend uh, to kind of get them to either go away or to kill some of them. It was so many that if I had uh, touched that area, they would have climbed on me very quickly and I would have been probably bitten very badly. One, two, three, four. Fabrics are down. Miss Izzy wants some love. Gotta climb over her. And off to work on the other side. Okay, so if you remember in a previous video, I had set up these trellises. Uh, these cattle panels rather as as trellises for my tomatoes so I have two rows here and so what I'm doing is I'm also laying the uh, landscaping fabric down the I can't explain it very well but down the center of the poles so I kind of had to cut and kind of cut a, an area so that it could fit around the poles nicely and then staple them down with landscaping fabric and this is also to keep down on the weed situation. 
because the weeds in this yard the grass in this yard has been untamed for so many years so and then I'm able to get over to the second set and also put down the manscaping fabric okay so I'm now back on the other side and I have this bird feeder up from last year and I went ahead and put it in the middle or center of, of the garden on the first side you saw me work on. I enjoy watching the birds come in the garden. So I make sure they have food and water. Okay, so back to the other side again. I am um, cutting out some uh, probably about uh, two to three inch holes in the fabric so that I can plant my seedlings. In this area, I plan on planting some of my kale. So that's what I'm doing now. I'm just prepping that area. Miss Izzy's coming over to see what I'm doing. She loves love, lots of snuggles. for watching. See you soon.